My name is Richard Bolton, um, I work for Brymore Construction Limited and I'm currently in charge of the uh, restoration and conservation of Netley Chapel um, for Hampshire County Council. We are currently doing a £2.3 million refurb which involves the upgrade of the mechanical and electrical systems, a full refurbishment of the ceiling, a full refurbishment of the windows and a lot of um, external works just to bring it up to um, a standard for the public to use and to bring this uh, space back into public use. The chapel was built between 1853 and 19, uh, 1862. Um, it was the largest military hospital um, in Europe at the time. Um, Queen Victoria visited here over 20 times and also Florence Nightingale made a few visits here. Uh, this was built after the Crimean War and it was used as a training hospital um, right up through the Second World War. One of the major parts of the project has been to refurbish the windows. Um, we've had specialist carpenters come in who have had to uh, generate the window glazing beads that were built in the 1850s. Um, and we've also had over £60,000 worth of handmade etched glass put in, which all has to be specially dyed. Um, we've, all the etched glass has been replaced and we've now got fully functional windows once again. One of the largest expenses on site has been the mechanical and electrical installation that we've had to do. 95% um, of this won't be seen by the general public as we've managed to hide it within the floor void. This now contains over half a million pounds worth of mechanical and electrical installation, which means we'll have a hearing induction loops, we'll have data cables, we'll have Wi-Fi, you'll have heating. The ceiling above us um, has been repainted, it's been repainted um, as to an, an artistic impression of what it was originally. Um, directly above us we have large oak beams, which one of the stories is they were taken off a ship at one time. Um, they are all pegged and pinned together. Um, there's no screws, no nails within them, and it's pure craftsmanship from the 1850s. Many thanks for watching, and if you'd like to like and subscribe for more content from the park, it'd be great. Thank you.